March the 18th, 2023. Guys, you're looking at the National Weather Service map, and that large dark purple area that you see over the southeast, these are freeze warnings for tonight. Below that, along the coast of Louisiana, Mississippi, Alabama, and Florida, and up through Georgia, all the way through the Carolinas, you have a freeze watch. Now, our county's in this freeze warning, and it's unusual for this time of the year, but nothing has been normal in the weather for the last few years. We've seen it from the hurricanes to the unusual snowpack and the flooding that we see going on. You guys in California and the, uh, along the Sierras, there, you've got a winter storm watch. And you along the Great Lakes, you've got these winter weather watches and warnings along there, gale warnings along many of our shores down in southwest Texas. You guys also have this winter weather watches. So winter's not over yet, but this hard freeze warning is why I'm here that you see from Texas up through the Carolinas. A lot of spring plants and fruit trees and things like that are budding. And uh, they're going to be, if they're not covered up, they're going to be lost. And so that's kind of a big deal here. A lot of people plant, some plant early. Not a lot of major gardens or, any, or anything yet, but uh, your pets, your plants, things like that, you need to be thinking about it now. This is going to come tonight, and it's going to last until probably Monday. You can have very cold times both nights. We'll just take a look at uh, some of the information here. And if you click on the map we were just on, which is at weather.gov, then you can go to your area, click on that area, and you will come up with more detailed information. This I clicked on is central Mississippi, coming out of Jackson, Mississippi. And in the red area, is that's significant freeze expected tonight through Sunday morning. Now, I think Sunday night it's going to get uh, cold also in the same areas. It says temps will fall below 32 for more than three hours. Low temps, mid to upper 20s. Freeze warning in effect. Freeze ex expected with significant damage to unprotected vegetation. So, you know, a lot of us uh, plant gardens. I've held off this year. Sometimes I will have a few things in the ground, but I did not uh, think that this was over y with yet. I didn't know it was going to be this intense at this late in March, but I'm glad we were careful. Now, we're covering up uh, this afternoon uh, plums and uh, blueberry bushes. So, would be the, you know, the big trash bags and hope that that works. The um, area below that, which is McGee, Brookhaven, that area is low temps, upper 20s, near 30 degrees Fahrenheit, freeze warning in effect, damage to unprotected vegetation there. Below that, down to Hattiesburg and over in the uh, southwest corner, it's in the yellow area, limited, low temps around freezing, freeze watch in effect, minor damage to unprotected vegetation possible. So, guys, anywhere you are at, you can click on that big map and come here and or to the detail uh, section of your area. It says this freeze is expected tonight with temperatures falling as low as the middle to upper 20s, especially along and north of I-20. I-20 on this map, guys, runs from Meridian in the far right, coming out of Alabama, through Jackson, Mississippi, through Vicksburg, and then heads towards Shreveport in Dallas. It says the freeze warning is in effect for much of the area. Freeze watch is in effect for the Hattiesburg area. Significant damage to unprotected vegetation is possible, and that will occur, and you're going to see it happen. Only positive sign of or positive thing to come out of this would be the insects have been really bad. Trying to work outside, mosquitoes, gnats, things like that. They have taken advantage of an early spring and not a very cold winter. And so this may slow that down some. We'll have to wait and see. I'm not going to drag this thing out. Uh, it's loading slow. But guys, uh, I want to say thank you for the comments on the book of Revelation. That's uh, pretty neat. I appreciate that. And also in the video about the digital library that I did yesterday, I, I had a link for all the free. It was It's called the playlist of Revelation. But I'd put the link, I noticed just a few moments ago, to the first uh, video, Revelation chapters 1 through 3 instead of the playlist. So I have corrected that. And I want to, pre uh, again, thank you all for the comments. 
But guys, uh, we're watching this. And, uh, I'm going to back back out and look at this big map again, weather.gov, and uh, look at the area that's affected. You realize how much vegetation is in this in the early spring? So we just got to be careful. And guys, uh, with the weather changing, it's good to pay attention to what you're planning when you're planning it because nothing is predictable like it used to be. Things are really changing. We're watching it. You watch it. It's a heads up, guys. Be safe.